<laughs> I'm too old to remember what happened in the last hour and a half. Don't talk uh, about that. That's not worth so, talking about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, well, I, we were, I felt like watching film that I thought we were the better team. But I also know with state tournament games, um, you never know what's going to happen. Um, and they, they, they had some parts of their game that we were afraid, that were not afraid of, but concerned with their athletes up top and the number of their goals that they scored. But I thought our defense um, really nullified them. Um, Emily and, and captains of the defense, and she did a great job. And the four of them have been awesome. We've given up seven goals all year. Um, they did a great job. Sophia in the center mid um, does an incredible job of protecting them, playing balls in the air, um, just distributing the ball. Um, and I thought we really you know, moved the ball well today. Um, shared it, passed it quickly, combined up and down the field. Um, and then, uh, you know, I thought our offense attacking goal was, was solid and Olivia had the hat trick today. Was it three? It was. It was, nice, yes, <laughs> yes. So, so again, but the, Emily Metzel is a captain that, on the end. Um, Olivia Teal is in the middle. She's our uh, one of our forwards and Sophia here is our, our center uh, midfield. Olivia, how did it feel in the second half? Because you had a good first half, but you really seemed like you really wanted to, to kind of leave no doubt and, and you score the goals that left no doubt. Yeah, we wanted to really score off our start. It was kind of a big thing for us. Me and my other forward, Ali Rupentrop, were really adamant about scoring off that. <laughs> So that was an exciting one. I haven't scored more than one goal all season, so it was really exciting, exciting for me. And all the balls that were given to me were really amazing. So from Kayla and Allie. So it was easy to put my head on them and put them in the back of the net. Was there anything that didn't go to plan today? Like, oh, we, we, we've got to work on that, that they're exposing some weakness that maybe we didn't see or it was like, nah, we were, this was what we wanted to do. I think it was a really good team effort today and like our defense definitely like shut down. Like we were watching film and like we knew that all their goals were through like split passes and I think our defense did a really good job at not letting that happen. And yeah, I just think it was a really good team effort today. That's what got us the win. Came down to us wanting it more. Hey, one player with 27 goals, one with 19, and you paid special attention to them, or you guys just play the same same defense against anybody? I mean, um, go ahead. We talked about them, but really, we just kind of focused on our outside back stepping, making sure they couldn't turn. Faith Pepper, the other center back, stepping hard, and then me dropping, so I just weren't going to get the through ball. So we just played the same defense as we did, just made sure. We were on tonight. Okay. For any of the players, Monty has had a lot of success in this sport. Do you sense that at all, or is it just this is a whole new group, you know, that kind of thing? I think after last year, it's kind of just like a reset. Just can't take anything for granted. Got to just go out and play every game. Yeah, definitely motivated <coughs> us last year, losing in the section final. So, I mean, 11 seniors, we've all been working together for a long time, so it's. We've been growing with each other for a long time, especially since we lost in the state final two years ago. So in the goal in the first half, there, there's a whole bunch of bodies, and then all of a sudden, the ball going into the net. How did you get it into the net? Was it a header? Or was your I was just <laughs> body. I don't really know. Off your body? Went to the ball, yeah. Was it uh, up high? Or or where, did, where was the ball? Up high or down? Um, Waste. <laughs> Waste. Okay. So yeah. just went off your body into the net? Yeah. Okay. They all count. Yeah. Well, and there were so many people and it was hard to see. Yeah. Um, yeah. yeah. Happened so fast. I'm really going to ask you about the first goal. It was like about a 60 yard you sent her out on. And that was fake. The like, other center back sent the ball. Oh, okay. How big was that for you to get that one right away? It was huge. I think we always talk about like, Going right off the bat, getting the first, like getting up early. So it was just like, gave us confidence. And I think it's just like, for the people who haven't been here before, it just allowed us to take a breath and just settle in. But not drop down. Because Walt always says we tend to dial it back after our first goal. So 
we really really wanted to bring it and get a second. Yeah. And then just kept pushing so long. Kept up the intensity. You said it was faith at the long out with Yeah, Alley faith effort, yeah. Okay. I think they gave you the assist they were saying. I mean, I'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> What's your thoughts on Holy Angels? No big surprise that they're in the finals. Yeah. Well, I felt bad for Orno because I thought they played them pretty well. Um, and were misfortune. I, I, there's, I really haven't looked at Holy Angels until today um, because we didn't, until it happens. And so I'll go home tonight and watch their last couple games. Um, and all my coaching staff will, and we'll come back with a plan. And remember, you know what you through with them? Lost them two years ago in the state final shootout. I mean, we've, yeah, I mean, all the way back to, I think we lost to them in 2003 and then finished third place that year in the semis. It was a 3 2 game. And then we both, that was back with the random draw. And we, I think we won the third place game 7 0 and they won the championship 5 0. Um, we beat them in 2008 uh, in the final. So we've, we've seen them, we've seen them in the, in the semis and the quarters. And good, pretty good luck. And, we're excited to get another chance at him. And Olivia, you said it was Allie and Kayla for your line mates, so to speak. Um, Kayla plays on the outside, her and Ceci Emery, and then Allie Rippentrop plays in the left, left foot. Anything else, guys? I was just going to ask, compared to last year, were there any physical or mental differences in preparation for this season? I mean, I think this year, like like we said, we're very motivated. Like, after how our season ended last year, we all just want it super badly. But I also feel like we're really just working better together as a team. We all saw how upset the seniors were. It was a bad way to end. Mm -hmm. We dominated that game. We just knew that us being seniors would not want to end it like that again. There's 11 of them, so. Other questions? All right. Congratulations. Thank you.